Greetings, Stamp Hobby friends. Happy Labor Day, and welcome to the Monday Morning Brief for September 5th. Are you aware that the United States Postal Service has been funding a TV drama aimed at children? We weren't either until our Washington correspondent, Bill McAllister, reported the startling news August 29th. Citing a report posted on the Deadline Hollywood website, McAllister reports that the Postal Service has spent $5.4 million since 2014 on a program featuring postal inspectors and could spend millions more on the show, now in production for its second season on CBS. The show, titled The Inspectors, is based on actual cases handled by postal inspectors. The 30-minute episodes run on Saturday mornings when many kids park themselves in front of the TV. To learn more, McAllister contacted Paul Crenn, a spokesman for the U.S. Postal Inspection Service. According to Crenn, the show's funding comes from two sources, an assets forfeiture fund and criminal penalties paid by individuals prosecuted by the Postal Inspection Service. No funds come from taxpayers or postal ratepayers. Crenn also told Lenz that the Postal Inspection Service is proud of this innovative approach to consumer education and fraud prevention using television as a medium to extend the reach of our crime prevention campaign. The show's current contract runs to September 14th, with options to extend the contract two times for one-year periods, McAllister reports. If you collect or have a soft spot for butterflies on stamps, I have good news to report. The United States Postal Service announced August 30th that it plans to issue the sixth stamp in its popular and colorful butterfly series of stamps. No issue date has been announced for the stamp, which will satisfy the 68 cent rate for non-machinable first class mail, such as square greeting card envelopes. Featured on the stamp is a beautiful eastern tail blue butterfly. For Lynn Stamp News and the Scott Catalogs, I'm Chad Snee. Have a great week enjoying our wonderful hobby. Cheers!